Hey there, A Bird for New Fam. Wednesday is here. This Why Wednesday is going to be a little bit different. First, announcement. Thank you. Appreciation. 50 subscribers have been reached. Thank you to everybody who has liked, subscribed, commented on a video. I appreciate it. And we're now halfway to the commitment of a on location, error correct review video of an item. Now that's out of the way. So today's Why Wednesday is going to be on this chonky girl right here. It's going to be the Glock 21 Gen 3. So no optics cut with finger grooves and a 13 round 45 ACP magazine. Um, I Obviously, I like the 1911. I have nothing against Glocks. But my choice in Glocks is the Glock 21 for a number of reasons. Not just because it's chambered in the caliber of our Lord and Savior John Moses Browning, although that helps. But I do like the fact that it is a big pistol. There's no two ways around it. When you start double stacking 45 ACP, the pistol's got to get large to accommodate that. I like that due to the fact it gives me a better purchase. I still get a three, nice full 360 on full extension. But it also accommodates me to be able to get a little bit of a roll forward to reduce recoil. Or better control it through my forearm by not having a straight inline locked out wrist does have your rail in the front so you can add such as a TLR4 with a light and laser combination. Now just a little bit of interesting facts or factoids on the Glock 21 and then we're going to go ahead and there's some test fire range video coming up and test fire but you like it. This one happens to be a police trade-in as with all used firearms that come in my shop they all go to the range and they get a 50 round test fire to check for cycle of operations, functionability, and anything that may be wonky. So, 4.61 inch barrel, 13 round capacity, 45 ACP, spreading 230 grains of hate and discontent at the speed of a Volkswagen bus trying to go uphill in a headwind. Other than that, I got nothing for you. Thank you for watching this video. That's just a quick little why I like the Glock 21 Gen 3. And now, we're going to move over to the range. As always, like, comment, subscribe. Matter of fact, go ahead and jump down in the comments and put what model of Glock pistol you prefer from the Glock lineup. Just a quick little why. That's all I got. Here it is. Fourth of July is tomorrow. Everybody enjoy your freedom. Be good to each other. That's all I got. camera orientation so this is just going to be for the folks that are against a mag dump with 45 ACP um, it is a bit more than a 9 mil of course but like I said before this Glock 21 she's a big thick girl and sometimes when you take her to the dance she gets excited <laughs> But, it is actually very controllable. So, the Glock 21 Gen 3, please trade in. With it being a Glock, parts are readily available. There's plenty of Glock factory train armors, such as myself and many others. So, even buying a police trade-in, and you run it for a while, and you find that you need to make a few adjustments or repairs, likely you're still going to be well inside the cost of a new pistol. And you don't have to worry about all this talk about 500 round break-ins for trigger pull reduction and all of that. So, why I like it, chambered in 45, it's big, fills my hand, and uh, runs. Um, 